folks, Annette Evans here, Beauty Behind the Blast, here for Target Barn. I'm here to talk to you today about this concept of cross-dominance. You may have heard about it relating to your shooting, but not really known what to do about it. We'll make it easy. First of all, cross-dominance is the idea that you might be right-handed or left-handed, but your dominant eye is your right eye or your left eye, and it's not the same one. So I'm right-handed, and I'm left-eye dominant. Not sure which eye is dominant? Check our article below. Now, if you're cross-dominant, then there's a couple of different strategies you can use for pistols to make life a little easier. We'll talk about all of them, but then we'll get to my favorite. So I've got a blue gun here, and one of the most common strategies for cross-dominance is just close the eye you don't want to use. So you put your gun out, you close the eye, and then there's only one eye left to see the sights and line them up with the target. It's very simple, it's very intuitive, but then your face is all scrunched up. Another idea is, instead of scrunching up your face, you cover that eye. So you can do that with a piece of tape or um, some other cover on your shooting glasses. You could even just cover your eye entirely. Um, I think that the downsides of this are pretty obvious, and the upsides are, well, it's simple, and if you're only ever shooting your gun at the range, not really a big deal. Now, another way to do it is you can turn your head or tilt your head over so that the eye that you want to use is behind the sights. You're going to lose a little bit of peripheral vision doing that, and it's just not very comfortable. So how about another idea? Some people like to say, well, instead of turning your head, turn the gun a little bit over to the side. Guns aren't really designed to be used this way. It can cause a couple of issues. We'll talk about them below. So that's kind of not the best idea, but it's very close to what I like to recommend, and it's simple. Instead of holding your gun up right in front of you in the middle, shift it over just a tiny little bit, and that's going to line up your eye with the sights with the target. It's very natural, it's very easy, and it's something that you're going to find repeatable every day.